on the Super Nintendo with the Super Game Boy attachment. Let's get started here. I'm already at the spot we need to be, but the first thing you do is you're going to move down and press start before the guy there gets his exclamation point. The only thing important to have before doing any of this is to have Abra here, because Abra has the move teleport, and that's exactly what we're going to do. So before you do anything, make sure you go to the Pokemon Center here in Cerulean, catch an Abra in that area that the man is in without alerting him. And if you did that correctly, well, you'll be exactly where I'm at, and the start screen will not be appearing anytime you press it. So now you head up to the Nugget Bridge. That area you see to the left there with that little rocky ledge, that's the area with Abra. And go away a little longer across the path. I knocked out these trainers a little earlier for this. So you want to make sure that you're not directly in front of him, otherwise the game will freeze, but he has a level 17 slowpoke, and all you gotta do is take him down, so that's exactly what I'm going to do here. Well, we got the fun out of the way, so since we did a battle, we got the start menu back. So we're going to take Abra here and teleport back to the Pokemon Center. And the main things you got to have before doing this is a Pokemon that can do anything that involves sleeping or paralysis. For they'll help you catch Mew. Other than that you just need a whole bunch of Pokeballs and luck. So as you can see the start menu came up on its own and you got a little guy there in the corner and he's going to warped away from us and there's Mew in his Japanese form at a modest level 7 throwing out my Magikarp for the sake of we've been trying to level him up to get a Gyarados so there's my Pikachu but I'm going to use my Butterfree and Mew is only using Pound here so we only have to just worry about making sure we don't actually kill him. Uh, let's see. We'll throw a magic card back out. And we get hit with a pound again. It only takes three damage. So now that we got our magic card out, we can control our damage fairly well. As well as not take a whole lot and, you know, harm our party. And, you know, we're almost there. This little couple more attacks ought to do it. Alright, now we're going to do our poke ball. Already down to 4 HP, let's throw that ball, and let's see, nope, nope, he did not get it, that's a shame, down to 1, last chance for Magikarp, oh, oh, huh? we did it, we got Mew, so, that's Mew, not gonna nickname him, and, uh, let's go back to the Pokemon Center and check him out. Alrighty, so here's Mew in his Japanese form. Uh, he's got decent stats. Uh, let's see, 78 till 8 and 38 pounds. Swap him with Magikarp so we can level him up. So let's head to that right now. And let's see, the first thing we run into is Sweet Asantru. I haven't caught one yet. So we can. Give me a little bit of a test run here and show you what he's got. Just making sure 
we get him down up and catch him with the ball. Alrighty, kids. That's all I got to show for you today. That's how you catch me in the old Pokemon games.